What are you doing here? So to create the pattern protruding on top, you need to weave extra yarn into it. <laughs> so um, these strings are risen, which helps me. My focus isn't good. Which helps me know uh, which <laughs> which the thread goes behind like this. And the risen strings are risen because of this paddle here. Um, and then? And the paddle separates the strings that are already organised at the top. Fire. Sticks. Yeah. It's quite and so I'm lowering those strings down now to do a regular... A regular... Ooh, can't cope with the aperture. Right, you're very close there, little Lise. <laughs> You might need to come back a bit. Don't tell me what to do. Okay, let me take it to do. Then I do another lot. So, as you can see at the moment, the strings are all flat. Yes. And then I turn the paddle here, as you can see. Turning the paddle, yeah. Yep. Yeah. And then it raises these strings. These strings. And then I bring that back round again. So it's a much quicker, more effective and accurate way of creating pattern in this preset. Fun time with Rebecca Swansby. <laughs> <laughs>